Made in the Arklamis. Sponsored by Neela Mack, the Monroe Chamber of Commerce and Louisiana National Bank. I'm Paul Perkins, welcome to Barry Global. Uh, we are a manufacturer of uh, institutional can liners, trash bags, uh, greenhouse films, and uh, retail uh, sheeting. Uh, you may know it as uh, uh, drop cloths at your local hardware store. You know, we opened in 1979 under Sunbelt Plastics. In 1999, we sold to Tyco Plastics, and in 2007, we became Berry Plastics, and then a couple years ago, we changed to Berry Global. You know what, instead of me just talking about it, let me just show you what we do. Follow me. Yeah, a little bit about our process. We, uh, we're a bone film manufacturer, polyethylene resins. Everything comes in in a rail car to us. Uh, we are producing roughly 90 million pounds a year of the three different product lines. You know, the polyethylene is brought in the rail cars, pumped into a silo, and then from the silo, we uh, bring it to the plant, into an extruder, and at that point, we determine if we want to make greenhouse film, we're going to make a trash bag, or we're going to make construction sheeting. So when the resin is brought in from a silo, it goes to an extruder where we melt the product, heat and pressure, goes up through a die. This is what we call the blown film process. We have air inside the bubble. We can adjust the thickness of the bag. If we want to uh, increase the, the gauge on it, we'll slow the line speed down just a little bit or increase the, increase the extruder speed. Uh, if we want to adjust the width, uh, we have uh, sensors that we can make an adjustment. So with all three uh, product lines being blown film extrusion, uh, once it released, uh, once it processes through the tower, at that point, we could, if it's going to be a bag, we would put a seal on it, serrate it, perf it, and wind it on a roll. If it's construction sheeting, the only change there is we would put a knife slit in it, open it up, and wind it on a cord roll, and then place in a box. If it's greenhouse film, we would basically run it the same way, but since this product is for four years, we actually put additives in it that uh, help it to withstand the sunlight for four years. We bring in another 12 million pounds a year of product that is purchased from the outside to avoid all this going into the landfill. It's product we can process and run back through our equipment. So we accumulate our scrap, place it in a scrap box, a big Gaylord box, and we bring it back to the recycling where we have reprocessed back into pellets so we extrude it back through our lines. This is what the reprocessed material looks like before it's pumped into the silo to go back to the extruder. Currently we're working on automating our process to improve the efficiencies of our equipment. And this is our warehouse where we store everything. We can store up to about 8 million pounds of product. This is our shipping area. We have 20 docks where we stage the product and then load it and ship it. I want to thank you for allowing me the opportunity to show you a little bit about what we do here at Berry Global. For more information, visit us at berryglobal.com. We've been here for 43 years and know that we're here to stay.